I'm sorry, Mr. President. I couldn't, uh, couldn't let the moment pass. So um, New York City has a very interesting and creative solution to this problem, um, which ignores a lot of the safety concerns that I just heard from my colleague, Senator Kruger. See, on Staten Island, the upstate of New York City, we have a deer problem. We have a lot of deer. But it's not as open and as expansive as the rest of New York State. In fact, we have 550,000 people crammed in on Staten Island. We have some open spaces, sure, but they're never too far from schools and young, short children. Uh, and so here's New York City's wonderful solution to the deer so-called problem on Staten Island, the only place really that still has open spaces and green areas uh, because we on Staten Island really love the environment and protect it, I think, in a way that is better than most other places around the city. So here's what they're doing. They've spent $4 million to date. They have people with high-powered rifles going into neighborhoods on Staten Island. They bait the deer. They put these huge piles of corn, uh, and they lure the deer in. And then they shoot the deer, never more than a few hundred feet from young children running around without tags and without signs on them saying, I'm a young child, don't shoot me. Uh, and they dart these deer, they put them under, and they give them a vasectomy. That's what New York City has spent $4 million doing over the last two years. They give these deer vasectomies. Now, sadly, what ends up happening is about 30% of these deer, after this procedure, because I'm sure they hired the best in New York City vasectomyologists, uh, about 30% of them are soon found to be dead. And it's sad, and it's tragic. And none of that meat goes to soup kitchens, goes to the needy. It's just wasted. In fact, they litter the sides of the road uh, minutes after they're given these vasectomies. So to my colleagues upstate, you might want to consider something like that or not, because it's ridiculous. I vote aye.